Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Until Next Time Podcast. I am your host, Nick, and introducing his triumphant return... Family. <laughs> Family, everybody! <laughs> ding, 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 ding! My name is Randy. My name is Randy. I'm sorry. I just well, uh, <laughs> do you want to show the people what you did to yourself? You mutilated yourself? I don't even know which one to look at. Good grief, he's naked! Gonna get an F in the chat, please. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay, put it back on. <laughs> I'm depressed. <laughs> put it back on. I'm disgusted. <laughs> I, can't, I, can't, I can't do the show with you looking like that. That Randy, that Randy. I don't want to say that what that Randy Well, I'm just going to say this right now. I'm going to fucking Florida. It's going to be butthole hot there. Shit. <laughs> but, but, butthole hot. Yeah, you know like when you're walking up a hill and your ass crack is just so fucking sweaty, it's emitting heat, so it causes its own like rim of 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 heat like when when clouds form a circle, it's hot, so it's like that, so it's like a rim of heat and sweat. It's like its own atmosphere. Exactly. It's like um it becomes its own biome. It's, it's Mount Vesuvius. Think about it. Think about it. It is its own biome. It has its own temperature from the rest of your body. It has its own smell from the rest its of the body. Own ecosystem. It's just things There's like shit crawling in and out. <laughs> things go there to die. <laughs> 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 it's a fucking absolute wasteland. It's like if you put a mic there, all you hear is. <laughs> <laughs> so, I know. <laughs> <laughs> Just what the fuck was that about? I know this is so random, but um, I feel like I'm n- I never got to like shout this person out or like give them their uh their respect. Mm-hmm. So QC, I don't know if you want to like move your headphones because I don't want to hurt your ears. <coughs> fuck, I forgot how it goes. I got nervous. I got stage fright. It's like what is it? Little like? bitch. Stop. <laughs> Wait, how does it go? <laughs> <laughs> you already forgot. The, he's Bro, talking about like, <laughs> R.I.P. D.M.X. I could have swore we already said rest. Did we? <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Well, R.I.P. again, D.M.X. Because you know you're still R.I.P. Though. What? 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 It's not. I'm not disrespecting you. I love Move, D.M.X. Bitch, get out the way. Get out the way. Is that even get out him? The way. Move, bitch. I heard, you know Get what? Out. I don't even know. I don't remember. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> so my dick. <laughs> super random. Super <laughs> random. But I, I heard that he was like, oh, this is fucked up. But I heard like the gay community was really like, RIP DMX. And then like, I guess old song surfaced and he's like, fucking homophobic. Man, I've always wanted to sing Christmas. <laughs> Root out the red nose reindeer. Come on, come on. Had a very shiny nose. Yeah. You remember that movie? It's with Chris Rock. Uh, no. Wait, really? It's like Chris oh, Rock's yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Oh, actually, yeah, I did. Br- you know what? I did bring this up. He's in jail. It's called Top Five. It's a pretty. It's an underrated movie. I it's fucking a good movie. Love those. Yeah, I think we. Come on, come yeah, on. Yeah, I did bring because I I brought that movie up, and I think we then that's when I brought up DMX. Well, either way. Yeah. See, we we're fans of Chris Rock before the slap. R.I.P. <laughs> DMX once more. And you know what? Another rapper. Okay, so like, oh fuck. In a more serious note. DMX stands for Dirty Minge. D- in a more serious <laughs> note. X. R.I.P. Um, R.I.P. Young Dolph. Yeah, that one hurt. Yeah, that one, yeah. It's Dolph! I fell asleep uh, with one huh? bitch and woke up with two, brother. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I came in the club with six bitches. My uncle said that's pimping. <laughs> Fuck it. Yeah, honestly, dude, shout out to that because like, I based my whole life off of one of his songs for like a week. <laughs> I got cocaine running through my motherfucking system, <clears throat> you know. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, no nah, real shit though. Like, uh, yeah. Rest in peace to Young Dove. Yeah. He was a inspiration. That man gave away a Lambo, right? Was it a Lambo? D- to a fan, right? Yeah, it was I the do orange remember and blue that. one. Yeah, uh, I just don't want to talk about it because it is very sad. But you know what, though? Yeah, rest in peace, Young Dolph. I, f- I fucked with him heavy. I was bumping his music the you other day. You know what blows day, my mind? Like, oh, uh. He made a song with Young Gravy. Did he? Yeah. I Dude, th- Young Gravy has a song with Ski Mask, Chief Keef, and fucking Young Dolph. <laughs> and he's going on tour with fucking Limp Bizkit. <laughs> yeah. 
Limb Biscuit and Snot, I think. Yeah. You yeah. know what? I don't listen to Snot. I don't listen to Snot either. I remember that song you that he got really big for. He got really big song. off of one song. It was like Minecraft music. Like the beat, like the yeah. ambiance, and he rapped over that one. Real quick, everybody who watches, just know that we are in development of big and better things. We will get Mr. QC his own mic and hopefully his own camera. So every time he wants to chime in and talk, he has his own little his his area his view because I don't remember agreeing to this. I feel like you know it's kind of like he, his voice is echoed, and you know what? I don't feel that we should be doing that. His voice should be heard. <laughs> don't you make a fucking joke? <laughs> don't you go, make go ahead, a put fucking a, put joke? Put up your fist, bro. <laughs> go ahead, <laughs> speak for him. Or like a, or another white person would. I'm not speaking speak for, for nobody, you're bro. You're speaking for him, bro. That's what you're doing. <laughs> QC can speak for himself. How come the white man has to hold the mic? Oh, okay, he really? Because you know what's funny? Is that you just said that you didn't approve of giving <laughs> this black man a mic for voice Why are you bringing to be race heard. Into this? Well, because you were hinting at it. So let's, let's really talk about it, bro. What's your problem? Are you uncomfortable right now? Huh? 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 <laughs> I, you know yeah, what I do? Fuck you, I don't asshole. see color. I have, I'm color blocked. That's even, you know what? That's even, even worse more in some cases. <laughs> <laughs> Look, bro, we're not going to get politically charged. I just want to say that my friend, my friend QC, Listen, I feel like I, he deserves I, I, a I mic. Said, I don't remember agreeing to this, but I, I, wasn't, a, mm. I wasn't against it. He's, he's Although this man out here storming the, the, the fucking shed like the Capitol. Oh, really? I'm sorry about <laughs> Why you... Why are you trying to suppress Quince, bro? Tell me about that. I feel like it's more racist that we just keep throwing it in Quince. <laughs> it's you, you fucking asshole. No. I genuinely came up and was like, hey, like, you know, people who are listening to our podcast. You challenged they, me. They hear, yeah. You and tell I'm, me not and, to stay in jail. And I'm going to fucking, I'm going to challenge you right back, buddy. My face is red. Stop it. Because hear me out. I feel like some people who watch it, they'll hear him in the background and they're like, That's like, oh, like, true. what is he saying? You know what I mean? So it's just like, hey, like, it'd be cool if our fucking best friend has a fucking mic, bro, and you're over <laughs> here trying to run it through so much fucking shit. It's almost like that one movie with the... Don't you fucking start with that <laughs> with, movie. With, 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 Stop. With the brothers? You know, I just saw it the other and day, I, I think there's one, two, three, four brothers. Sh ding, ding, ding. Shout out Crack, a.k.a. Connor... We, I was at a fucking party on the weekend when all of us were so hammered, dude. I'm not going to lie. And like, we're just chilling on the couch at a party, and this dude just puts on four brothers. <laughs> for, for those who don't know, I don't know why, but we just have this inside joke that anything that happens to us, we relate it to the movie Four Brothers. It's like, oh, that thing that happened <laughs> in the, the Four Brothers. It's like that one movie, Four Brothers. It's <laughs> so funny. He's like, he's just like yeah, uh, Tyrese Gibson's in there. I'm like, is one of the brothers? He goes, I don't remember. Like, I haven't seen it in a long time. I'm like, are you just racist? Like, you just you just think, of, like, fucking Tyrese Gibson's in that movie? But in the back of my head, I knew he was in the movie. Uh, I just kept fucking with him. See, bro, see what you're doing to people, bro? And then you don't like it when it happens to you. Oh, that's not. Um, well, yeah. I'm, uh, speaking of movies. <laughs> I'm just a piece of shit. Uh, speaking of movies, um, we finally got to enjoy the Mortal Kombat uh, 2, the animated one. Mortal Kombat Legends, baby. Yes, oh, sir. That was a good one. So for people. I, who I don't know. You know what? I like it. It was the hype. hype. I like the hype. <laughs> but like the thing is, uh, for people who don't know, there's three timelines for Mortal Kombat. The three timelines goes from one to eight. The other one goes from nine to eleven. And Mortal Kombat Legends is a its own timeline. It's its own story, but it's the same characters, all that. It's not like fucking Marvel where they make like a billion different superheroes and they're all different names and different powers. It's like, yeah, this is fucking you Spider Man. Like a, you mean like a like a billion timelines, right? Yeah, but yeah. like you get me, but like each not even the timelines, sometimes they'll say like just it's a different universe and like it's like, oh, this Spider Man's fucking green and his name's like Andrew shit. You get me? Like some shit like that. Mortal Kombat timeline, it's a timeline. It's not universe, it's just timelines. Like, just yeah. parallel time like, uh, timelines. So it's the same fucking thing. Well, people, wouldn't you say that different a different directions. timeline is a different universe? No, because time and, you know, time and a place is different. <laughs> okay, NASA. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, no, but anyways, back to the movie. The first one's called Scorpion's Revenge. And that um, was, oh. Mm, mm. 
Mm. Fire. The voice that they use the actual voice for the Mortal Kombat games, the Scorpion, to play as Scorpion in that movie, which I highly appreciate. Yeah, that movie. Um, you know, it, it is a. Big it was set. better than the live action right off the bat. I think we said that before. <laughs> right actually. there, yeah. I, you know, we're we're going back. We're we're pulling some things that we've said before, it's but um, true. but no, no, no. But the second movie. Okay, I, we actually never got to talk about it. I actually liked the first movie more. Yeah, I did too. But the second movie... The second one, I, okay, I'm going to be real. I the liked second one's it. really good. Had a very stir, firm story. And then I felt like they just got super lazy at the end. Lost me at the end. <laughs> like, I was kind of hoping for Fire God Liu Kang. Yeah. I, I, well, instead I of like golden Liu Kang. What is there some shit? Yeah, like, but you know, I, I wanted him like the flames. Like, you know, when he's all... F- yeah. Flame on! No, like I wanted... <laughs> him to like you know like it goes into his body and he has like the you know he looks there are fates worse than death oh r.i.p raiden <laughs> <laughs> oh shit nah, that's all good but just, let me just get rid of <laughs> oh don't worry there's a karibo in there um but r.i.p r.i.p raiden R. I. P. honestly personally I, look it Obviously, I've never created anything like that where, you know, whatever, whatever, whatever. But, like, story-wise, Raiden in this movie, if you don't know, he, Raiden is a god, Lord Raiden. And, you know, in this one, he says, oh, I'll be in the final tournament because they do a second Mortal Kombat tournament. And he's like, I'll be in it, but you can make me human or whatever, yeah. right? He's so like, you got to give up your And, oh, and your you know god what? Status. It was kind of useless. Yeah. Because he fucking died. Like... You know, like didn't he, even matter for the he died, life. but like he didn't do anything. His death did something, but not him. Like who did he fight? Who's the last person he fought? Shao, Shao Kahn. Shao Kahn killed him, but like, and then that motivated Liu Kang. But I yeah! feel like the the issue there <laughs> was, um, like I'm sorry. I've just it's it's okay, bro. It's just you know it's your favorite character. Yeah, bro. people know this. No, actually, <laughs> Liu Kang is not my favorite character. Oh well, then you're. I racist. love him. I love him the <laughs> fu- like fucking crazy. It's my second favorite character. That's it. I'm not gonna say who Fujin. The first one. Why the fuck would Fujin be my favorite I don't character? Know. Fujin's like Omaga. I hate a Unaga. Umaga. Unaga. Umaga. <laughs> Unaga. Unaga the Dragon King. No, not him either. Oh, Johnny. Dude, see this How is like QC does need a mic. Oh, yes, shut the fuck true. up. He, you don't, don't want to give him a mic. <laughs> I see it in he your eyes. He got it right. He said Johnny, Mr. Johnny. Zoom into his eyes. Yeah, Mr. Cage right there. <sighs> those eyes. Those eyes don't want progress <laughs> anyways my bad totally johnny I can, johnny just slipped my fucking yeah, mind, johnny bro. cage has always been my favorite character you know what yeah. i remember when nine first came out and people because johnny cage is fucking useless in armageddon like it, i guess like his moveset was horrible i remember well that's what i remember as a kid and a lot of my friends hated him just because he was an annoying fucking character you know just like spontaneous think he's the best best shit ever when nine came out and they finally, because Johnny Cage had a shirt at Armageddon, I think, or I think he was just really buff, uh, and like it looked like a fucking shirt because it was pixelated. Yeah. But uh, when Mortal Kombat Nine came out, they came out with a very brave thought of putting the just fucking Johnny tatted across his chest. I don't yeah. Know, oh <laughs> and my then people God. are just like, why would they make this character even more fucking <laughs> full of himself? More obnoxious. And you know what? I fucking loved him for it. I was like. This dude's fucking badass. I mean, we have the Mortal Kombat 9 poster right over there. But yeah, I just never put it up. Because it was a little, a little wrinkled. It's, it's, but it's really ripped. It's really old. I actually got it the day Mortal Kombat 9 came out. Maybe we should get some Mortal Kombat statues. I should. I want Shout to. out to Mortal Kombat 9 for making all the women busty. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> it was insane. Well, he also had a... a when when like they were beat up, their fucking clothes would constantly rip, and they'd have yeah. scars and be cut up. That was, like, oh was yeah, yeah, yeah. When you're getting beat up, I'm all like, D- look it, okay. I was middle school when that game come out. Okay, I was like, oh my god, they're busty. <laughs> Just kidding. You know what? I feel like if I was gonna get a video game tattoo, there'd only be two, and it's only two games. It's Gears of War. Mm-hmm. That story was just so amazing to me. It was my first introduction to, into like a real life good fucking story, just off the bat with a new console. Number two would be Mortal Kombat, but okay. Mortal, Mortal Kombat would probably be the first priority before Gears of War. Okay, because Mortal Kombat's just been there since. Come on, I had a Nintendo sixty four playing fucking two and three. So can I give you their ideas for it? Yeah. Okay, Mortal Kombat, the dragon in your chest, and it just says Mortal Kombat. Gears of War, 
main character's name is Marcus. Oh, I'm not gonna get any of those. Who's char- like, I'm just gonna. No, get but is the main character named Marcus? Yeah, it's Marcus Phoenix. Just blasted <laughs> just on my blasted. fucking blasted. <laughs> Marcus Phoenix, everybody. No, it's fucking, you know those half faces where it's Marcus yeah. Phoenix and Johnny yeah. Cage? <laughs> I'll try to put that together, but yes, exactly, bro. That would just be absolutely beautiful. Oh, fuck. <laughs> so, I know there was some shit you wanted me to talk about in the pod. Fuck, I forgot what no, it was. No, it's no big deal. Um, Just to let everyone know, this is going to be a kind of a l- little short one. It's going to be short and sweet little pod, you know. <laughs> but um, do you want to run lines? Do you want to run lines? Just yeah, I'll bat? run lines. Yeah, right, we'll run lines. Do it. Let me s- we're going to run more lines right now. And I'm going to give him the best part. Yeah. So for those who don't know, last week we did the notebook. And right away I want to apologize. We got too into it. We didn't know that we had our heads cut off. But, I mean, my boy over here was just selling it. Um, I don't think... This time around, we're going to be jumping out of our seat. No, so no, but you got to be angry. If we are, if we are, QC will adjust it. Okay, yeah. please. I'll, okay. Just, I'll just tell you. You are Lee Les. Les? Les Grossman. Les Grossman. I am also, I'm going to be Pecker and the Terrorist. <laughs> okay? Pecker and the Terrorist. And I want you to read, uh, what, what are they like, where like, he throws his phone and shit like that, you know? I want you to, I want you to read those uh, extras. He's in a meeting. Yeah, I know. In about two seconds. With the pecker. That's you. On the phone. Oh, on the phone. <laughs> I gotta sell it. Hold on, dude. I, I yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. <clears throat> just, just run it back. Run it back. Okay. <laughs> He's in a meeting. Yeah, I know. In about two seconds. With the pecker. I'm gonna rip your fucking tits off. You wanna talk trouble? That's trouble. Am I Matthew McConaughey? No, that's Pecker. That's Pecker? Okay. Pecker okay. walks into the office. You're Tom Cruise. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. What do you need, Peck? <laughs> no, more like, what do you need, Les? Glasses? What? So you can read the Tropic Thunder contract that guarantees my client, Tug Speedman, from some digital video recorder on location. Gives uh, gives contract to assistant. Look, fuckstick, I'm incredibly busy, so why don't you just get the hell out of here before I snap your dick off and jam it in your ass? Les gets back on the phone call whispering. <laughs> it's right there on the bottom. Oh, I, that's still me. Yeah. No, not, no, not you, Helen, but I will rip your tits off if you don't get me, the, if you don't get me those theaters. Phone begins to ring. Perfect. Peck answers. Hey Tucker Nets, I got you on the speaker on the speakerphone. I'm standing here with Lee Grossman, and he's and he's dying to tell you why he's apparently wiped his ass with the TiVo clause from your contract. We all flaming dragon. <laughs> Speed <in>. disclaimer. <laughs> This is the character he has to play. <laughs> Speedman is with us now. For fifty million, you will get him back. Who, who is this? And how did you get this phone? We are flaming dragon. Simple Jack belongs to us now. Oh, he does, does he? Let me tell you something, shitbird. I've never heard of your little agency, but you think you can poach my client? Fifty million dollar, no see simple, or you no see simple Jack again because we kill him. I'm grabbing the phone. This is Lee Grossman. Who is this? This is Flaming Dragon. <laughs> okay, Flaming Dragon. Fuck face. First, take a big step back. Literally, fuck your own face. Now, I don't know what kind of oh, what kind of Pan Pacific bullshit power play you're trying to pull here, but Asian Jack is my territory. So whatever you're thinking, you better think again. Otherwise, I'm going to have to head down there. <laughs> and I will and I will rain down an ungodly fucking firestorm upon you. You're going to have to call the fucking United Nations and get a fucking binding resolution to keep me from fucking destroying you. I'm talking scorched earth, motherfucker. Keep going. Oh, still, I will massacre you. I will fuck you up. Last line. Uh, could you uh, find out who that was? Tropic Thunder. Yeah. Obviously. 
I, I, I got to say, that's probably Tom Cruise's best as <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> I don't know what kind of Pappas is bullshit. <laughs> I, I need to, okay. I, I know I was looking her down a lot, and but I... <laughs> That threw me fucking off. Where did we watch it? We were just I don't <laughs> remember. <laughs> Bill Hader's oh the assistant. Oh my god, bro! I need. We need to rewatch that for sure. Fuck, where were we? We watched the whole fucking. Oh, we, we did. We watch it in Big Bear. Or was it Atlanta? Fuck! I don't even. <laughs> it was on. It was on your Amazon Prime, right? That's where we watched it. I so think, I had. I must have had my Apple TV. So it could have been that. I remember in Big Bear we watched Grown Ups. <laughs> oh fuck, dude! <laughs> we also watched Catch Me If You Can. Yeah, we did. Shout out Tom Hanks. <laughs> like I was about to say that's Leonardo DiCaprio. But yeah, you're <laughs> yeah. Like, Tom like, Hanks like he fucking it. needs it. You know. What's so funny is I was thinking of that movie the other day, and I was just like, I was just like, you gonna tell me how'd you pass the bar exam? And then didn't he just say, I studied? <laughs> I don't fucking know. So yeah, this Wait, no, it was like it was like the Mortal Kombat movie <laughs> that we watched when Raiden, Raiden, yeah. he's like, um, I'll be Luke Kane, you're Raiden. How did you know I was the chosen one? Because I chose you. <laughs> It's like wow, <laughs> awesome, Raiden. That's Anyways, awesome. Anyways, I hope I did a good job on the Tropic you Thunder. You did. You did okay. It threw me off. <laughs> it fucking threw me off. It's fucking out there. But I like. I gotta say, that's probably Tom Cruise's best fucking. Performance. I wish. You know what? Maybe one day I could go back and I'm gonna rewatch it and then I'll perform it and I'll even do better. But Jesus Christ, dude. <laughs> you're gonna have to take a step back and literally fuck your own face. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Fucking, I remember that scene. I'm sorry, QC, uh, I yelled We're just killing QC's ears. All right. <laughs> You're going to have to get a fucking unbinding resolu- revolu- resolution of the fucking United Nations. <laughs> Jesus Oh, fuck. Christ. We haven't done this in a while. We have not. Any final thoughts? It's funny because I'm just like, we have not, and I don't even know what you're talking <laughs> no, about. No, we're just that connected. Any final thoughts? No, there is no final thoughts. <laughs> Sick. Wait, there is final thoughts. Yeah, what's up? Real, 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 real final thoughts. Okay. I just found out janitors get paid as much as t- uh, teachers in some states. Really? Yeah. But in, I, I'm sorry. I'm just gonna say, you know, isn't that kind of fucked? Because teachers are always fighting for like higher pay, and then like yeah. you go to school, and then one day just some guy is, you know, no disrespect to janitors, they do a great job, but they're just like. Fucking, we're getting paid the same as you. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, c- custodian. You called them that, Custodian, too. yeah. Also. I'm racist because <laughs> cause, cause when you said no offense, I thought you were going to do like um, like a really racist Mexican accent <laughs> for the janitor. <laughs> <laughs> no, all Mexicans are, are janitors. Uh, no, bro. I'm not saying no, that. You fuck. Oh, that's what you oh my god! No, 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 no. The no. guy's trying no, to no, fight. No, 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 no. Wrong, <laughs> wrong, so, wrong. You know what? Wrong. Here's another. Here's another. It's not a final thought. It's what happened. It was because of the Key and Pill skit when he's all like, "No," he's like, "Sorry, muffins are only for sales associates." Okay. <laughs> Do you remember that? Yeah. Okay, there you go. Oh, so just funny thing. So before Jesus. I was late. I was super late here solely for the reason that this fucking uh this guy told me he's like, Hey, he pulled up, let's do a podcast. And I was like, Yeah. So I'm on my way, I fold all my fucking clothes, I throw them on the bed, and I'm all like, All right, I'm I'm rushing out, my dad goes, Where are you going? I'm like, Oh, I'm going out <laughs> with my friends. He's just like, No, you gotta do me a favor, can you go get me lottery tickets? And I go, What? Right now? Like I've been here for like the last four hours, I'm like, just give me lottery tickets. I'm like, what the fuck? Like, okay, so I'm driving by. You already know the middle school that's right next what to my house. What is this, 1993? <laughs> <laughs> fucking, if we win, we win, though. But still, <laughs> you, know, you already know the middle school I was passing by? Yeah, yeah, this yeah. Is why I was, this is why I brought up the, the custodian thing. I drove by, and I saw a custodian pull up in a fucking uh, Dodge Challenger. Oh, shit. Yeah, brand new Dodge Challenger. Steps out. Most handsome fucking guy I've ever met. All fucking jokes aside. This man looks like those fucking movies where, like, the janitor is just ungodly sexy for no reason. Like, handsome Squidward? Like, God, no. No. You know how handsome he is? That that Chad? 
the super the, chad the chad meme right here i know we might get in trouble because it's a bring me the horizon song but still right here uh yeah because it's uh it's can you feel my heart but still like uh oh yeah no i'm just talking about the picture the, though oh yeah. giga chad yeah, yeah. well, like he you know who he looked like chris hemsworth fucking thor oh, shit bro i was like Thor's holy up shit, shit this man's right here like <laughs> i'm about to clean up some shit right now <laughs> I don't know why it's a cowboy ice. Fucking got it. <laughs> this guy fucking sounds dope. Holy shit! This man was chiseled. This man was. This man was chiseled by Michelangelo himself. Just made him like a Greek god. That and is a. Uh, that's one wild final thought. <laughs> yeah, but like, dude, he stepped out of the Dodge Challenger. Fucking so so, what do you want to say? That, that okay. So bef- so we'll end it on this. Do you want janitors to get paid as much as teachers or no? Well, if they're throwing that ass back like that shit, they should get paid whatever they Throw want. that ass bike on a tricycle, baby. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just, and just cuts off right there. Like always. Until next time. Until next time.